yes yes ma'am uh, i am shahan laik i did my mbbs from dali medical university which is situated in china and after that uh, i have given the fmg january uh, 2024 and this time uh, this was my first attempt and i uh, made a score of 174 173 sorry mm. okay okay so i think you you have done your best like uh, you know like in the first attempt getting such a nice score is uh, you know like amazing and i'm sure that you and your family are very very happy so how are you feeling yes. like can you just describe like when you were seeing your result and when you got your score so how was your response to it <clears throat> yes ma'am i'm very happy and when uh, my family are also very happy they are like uh, first when they saw the, uh, i when i saw i just can uh, believe that uh, it is true then after i i was just rechecking again and again and then i understood that it is true yeah yeah like yeah. it is sure, a dream coming true yeah. yeah i'm sure you have done you have given your best like you know like you have done all the effort and that is why like you know you have scored it in your first attempt so ashan uh, just wanted to know like uh, our students wanted to know that uh, what was your preparation strategy and you know like how the dams uh, have played a role in that uh, you know like while you were preparing because it was your first attempt so i'm sure there are many students who are looking forward uh, you know like how they can do the same uh, you know like you have done so can you just uh, help us out just what you did and uh, like how we have helped you okay ma'am Mm-hmm. basically uh, i started my preparation during the covid pandemic time uh, okay. in 2020 uh, because it at that time there was a lot of time so i utilized that time and uh, i i bought uh, dams notes also i read from there and also watched the videos available uh, dams videos available on the youtube also i watched your videos also on uh, dermatology images session was really nice because uh, we can easily differentiate between different dermatological conditions like pemphigus pemphigus generally they keep on asking these things so it was really nice very good so i, I understand a lot from there and my concepts uh, got built up mm-hmm. basically i used to practice the pyq pyq uh, and also the um, uh, pyts like the past year questions and past year topics because uh, they are sometimes repeated and uh we must uh, know not only fmg question but also neat pg question that is very important because most of the student what they do wrong is they only do the fmg questions but actually yeah. we we should not only focus in fmg but also neat pg when you do the neat pg questions also your concept will be like super high you will understand more and uh, actually this more. is uh, absolutely correct because you know when i was taking the classes uh, for the fmg students i always ask them to at least do the last uh, you know 3 to 4 year paper of neat mm-hmm. pg also because somehow like i've seen that uh, particularly in dermatology if i talk about like i've seen the questions mm-hmm. coming from here to there and there to here mm-hmm. so it is always best and as you correctly said and all my students should listen to this that along with pyq it was the pyt which is more important because mm-hmm. uh, few students say that ma'am the question was not a direct repeat but at least the topic mm-hmm. was something which is same so yeah. uh, like uh, along with pyq like uh, what what was the different uh, like how did you give your gts and all and how frequently you used to give these tests uh, can you just describe about that as well uh, basically um, i give uh, gt every month one gt only and okay. not more than that yeah okay. and i mainly focused on revision Yeah. the past year topics and past year questions i should i was like revising and revising and again and again and again same thing and same thing mm-hmm. otherwise uh, I, i thought like giving gt is okay good you can understand like how what is my position and uh, in gt also i got like 170 uh, to 80 marks here also i got 173 mm-hmm. same There so you are, like, you just got a you know like a real time uh, you know among the uh, more number of student the real time picture uh, can be you mm-hmm. know like easily predicted when you give multiple gts and something which mm-hmm. you told was very nice that you know uh, you have given your special attention towards the revision 
because i've seen mm. students they just keep on collecting the material and you know at the end they have so mm. many things and you know like mm. they don't have time to revise it so please mm. remember first thing which we learned from this interview today is that uh, the pyt is important and second revision mm. revision revision like multiple mm. revisions will obviously make uh, you know you better and it will help you solve the different varieties of the question uh, one more thing shahan like how, what do you feel about the paper like uh, was it a one liner because you know there are many people who feel that okay fmg paper to it is always one liner it is very easy mm. to solve or you felt that no it was like more towards a clinical uh, you know like uh, i was talking to some other student and he was telling me that mm. ma'am it was as if uh, i'm sitting in an opd and they have described the question mm. so what is your take on to this uh i will say the question was not one liner the question was uh, fully clinical based and uh, that also they also given the mcq in such a manner that uh, the they make sure that uh, not uh, this question has not come ever in the exam like they will give from different other topics which have not come in the exam so we should also know the other options if there is one option is there there are four options when you are studying any mcq any past year question you should know the other options yes. that other option is a topic for the next question next yeah. exam yeah and and mm. this will actually help you rule out uh, at least if you mm. know yeah. about the options you can at least rule out like you know that yeah. there is a clinical history given and there are four option and if you know about each of them at least the probability of uh, marking the question right increases so that is also something very important so shahan now the exam is done the score was amazing so now what is your future plans like obviously i will not say that you will be studying like you know the from the next day only so like what you will do next now tell me like where are you going for <laughs> vacation or something or anything like that so uh, basically i'm thinking of uh... going to kashmir and okay. just uh, travel <laughs> yeah so yeah some break is obviously right now the break is needed and this is a relaxing sort of a break and uh, yes. like what is your plan later like once you are all done relaxed what is your because this is your one step like you are one step closer to your post graduation now so now what is what is your next step like anything any plans you have made uh, for now yeah ma'am i gen i uh, would like to uh, continue my study and hard work and uh, i would uh, 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 i want to crack the neat pg as well because uh, uh, and uh, get any clinical branch for that i will study that is yeah, my plan yeah so that's very nice and obviously like mm -hmm. you you have already uh, explained the way you have uh, you know prepared for fmg and i'm sure like mm -hmm. if you continue the same approach of uh, you know revising mm -hmm. the pyts at least knowing the mm -hmm. multiple topics which are frequently asked doing the gts i think this will help you crack the neat pg as well so just a last uh, thing i want to ask like uh, like how uh, like maybe there are many students who are in contact with you so like what do you tell them like uh, the 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 role of dams in your uh, preparation and you know how would you suggest the students uh, you know about the strategies which we have used and how they have helped you just the last uh, word I'll, i'll ask yeah i will tell um, you can take uh, dams notes and also videos they are very good you can utilize it and uh, i will uh, also tell uh, do the revisions more and more and solve the past years questions and past year topics of fmg and neat pg from dams it's uh, it will be helping helpful really mm. okay so thank you. thank you shahan it was very nice talking to you and congratulations once again i'm sure like you know like uh, i i'm sure that i will be taking your interview like maybe after neat pg also hope for the best mm. and uh, thank you for mm. uh, you know like be with us you know i'm sure that uh, at this time you want it more to be with your family but you have taken time to talk to us so very nice and uh, have a nice day shahan okay thank you thank you thank you so much